cakes and crackers and <laughs> I just I was just typing this stuff. He well, says this motherfucker. He goes, <laughs> I, I just wrote a little bit about myself. <laughs> His shit's like a mini paragraph. Ours is two lines. I think we're long live. player of Yu-Gi-Oh! <laughs> and now second grade teacher in New Jersey. That's it for you, fucking Mr. Rockwell. But you like cheese and crackers? Yeah, and I don't even get a jackalman underneath so... my name. <laughs> All right. Okay, so if we are recording and this did happen to go live, that's a lot of Houtinis. Houtini! Are we live? We might be. Who knows? <laughs> <laughs> who, who knows? I don't know. I'm refreshing our page now to see. That picture of Kevin's Probably so good. You not. Better, you better put my sexy picture up. Are we live? We are live. <laughs> oh, I look, goodness. I look like a child on this thing. Um... All right, here we go. Hey, this is Ashton. <laughs> this is Kevin. And this is Ray, and you probably know too much already. <laughs> yeah. Sorry for the uh, the uh, the words. We all know about Ray and his cheese and crackers and being in the army. So we're talking about our new website. So we have a website that we were working on that uh, will probably I'm, be done there, shortly. There's a picture of where you cropped Taryn out of it. If, if you guys were to <laughs> see a little glimpse... It's super janky and it's it's coming a long way, don't. but uh, you're don't not allowed to see it. Just I'm gonna I'm gonna paint a beautiful picture for you. There's, there's... www.jackalmangames.com forward slash crew. Yes. <laughs> oh, Kevin. Oh man, it's actually it's not bad. We're working on it. Actually... And by where I mean Ashton. So we're streaming. I'm not even like paying attention to the game. I am so sorry, guys. We were just uh, trying to fix some stuff with the stream. All who, hey, Jedi Geek Girl, so many f bombs. <laughs> so uh, <laughs> we were live during that time. So we're really sorry about that. That's uh, Ray censorship. And here's the sad thing. Okay, so someone says to me, um, "That's Hi, horrible." Benji and Samuel here, and, and my brothers are here. I'm so sorry, Benji and Sammy. <laughs> Have mom pray for you. It'll be okay. You let your ears be blessed. Yeah, Ray just, uh, he gets on his little, uh, fits. Anyway, let's play some uh. Destiny. <laughs> hey, did we just gain a subscriber for F-Bombs? Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, here we Yo, go. These, these guys take risks. So, normally our <laughs> streams are not as janky as a lot of you guys know. But, uh, Kevin and Ray have been at store championships all day. I am sick and my throat is killing me. So this could be an adventure. I'm going to share this out, by the way. So no one else does it. I got my Boba Fett shirt on. Look at that. Boba Fett. Bear shirt today. No birds. Bear. Bear shirt. Bear shirt. Okay. Let's re-roll. <laughs> Bear shirt. All right. How is everyone doing? Uh, Well, other than their ears hurting. Look at that six right there. <laughs> I, can't, I don't even know what I said. Um, you just scream at the beginning of it, this Emma, Emma Effer, in the first five seconds of the stream. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry. Oh my gosh. You guys Why are you tired, Miss Jedi Geek Girl? Thank you for dropping by. I don't know. Is, is this your first one that you dropped by in and, and messaged us? Yeah. Uh, so I think this is the first time she's... I got all of that. Yeah, she, just, she clicked it and she... Just got an earful. Hey, typically we're like 15 people, so at least 15 people didn't hear it. Wait, hold on. Yeah. They can just go back and watch the recording. <laughs> <laughs> she thinks she's <laughs> deaf in her other ear. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, here we go, Charlie. Um, get my shields, buddy. Okay. Your turn. So, Ashton, stop talking as you play so me and Kevin can talk. Okay. Kev, what did you play today? What did I play today? I'm sorry, I'm listening to you cuss over and over again. Um, I played Sabine and um, Clone Trooper. Hmm. Very nice. And I went, I went two three, and it was super rad. I mean, um, the last time I played, I went two three, and I had a buy, so that second win was a buy. Uh, this time I was buyless, so I was very happy that I, I did it under my own power. I didn't need any help. Hell yeah, I think that was a good call. Uh, if the the mill apocalypse was upon us, then Sabine would be the champion to pull through. Um, I played one mill deck today. I play. It was Leia Luke three mill. Leia Luke three. 
interesting. Yeah, it was pretty weird. Um, I didn't mind it. It was a lot of fun to play against. Uh, my choice was to destroy Luke first, uh, to kill Luke first. Uh, because it's like, oh, Leia's mill. It's the same difference. You know, like Sabine doesn't mind to get milled. But as we were getting uh, closer and closer to the end of the game, I was like, oh, wait, she has a lot of hand. She's more of a hand mill than a deck mill. Yeah, yeah. So I was like, oh, this is this is bad. <laughs> but I pulled through and got it. So uh, if I was to replay that matchup, I would have went for Leia first. But he was just shielding, shielding up real hard with Luke. He was using the shield sides as shield sides. Yeah, yeah. So had, I saw one of the craziest decks today uh with luke three was luke three hondo okay the dude went three and two so really yeah so he knew what he was doing he's a good player though he actually knocked me out of the rochester regional uh his name's like adam smith he's a pretty pretty good player the world happened with these dice wow that was strange but they're like warped no what is up with that there you go all right. uh, your brothers want me to sing let it go but I'll, I'll wait I'll wait for a better time guys I yeah. see I see your message they're still mad at us about the f bombs yeah let's give it a minute oh my gosh my computer might crash don't say that nope it's not allowed I think I'm hosting the discord call are you are that's you? that's why it's glitching terrible <laughs> internet <laughs> uh are you really? I think I might be. I don't know. Nah, it's it's you're holding together. When it when it breaks, we'll fix it. But right now, it's fine. Hey Ray, what did you play today? All right, yeah. So I played um, at a store championship today, and I hung out with Mr. Chip. Oh, all of our people. Holy cow! Oh, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Sorry, I was reading Jedi Geek Girl stuff. Go ahead. Um, I hung out with Mr. Chip today has always a good time that's like the second time me and him got together and i played dude how do you say the guy's name the the freaking um the card i'm playing piet piet pite i don't know piet piet, piet yeah, sounds it. like punctious pilot but like i uh, like that you know <laughs> who played, that guy is yes i played yeah. e snoke uh single die piet and single die rebel trader and i went three and two Actually losing a game to R2P2, which was like karma. Yeah, you know, you were pushing that deck for a really long time, and then it comes and slaps you in the butt. Yep. <laughs> pi et. Thanks, Amanda. Or, was, yeah, Pi et. Uh, Amanda, pi. Give us, give, uh, tell us about him in, in three sentences. Please. Or one sentence. Give us a one sentence description of who the heck he is. I have no idea. Not He's a either. Star Wars character. P it. P it. P what, man? <laughs> Anyways. So, think... Ashton, what did you do today, man? I worked and put together about 70% of our website today. You worked? I thought you said you... <laughs> Wait, you have people that watch this, probably. I so I... <laughs> <laughs> oh, he leads the attack on Hoth. Thanks. Hmm. That's pretty interesting. Now, when we watch it, we'll know who he is. But he's my boy today. That that He's pretty consistent. Um, I saw... So, I was telling you, I saw a um, Luke 3 Hondo deck, which was strange. And then I saw a Piet Commando Commando deck, which was super consistent. Um... And no, that's Veers. Okay. Um, and what else did we see? Oh, the this deck that has like Rex, clone troop, elite Rex, clone trooper, Maz, or hired gun is like taking over the world. Yeah, I like, I played against the, the Maz version of that deck. That deck is super solid. Yeah. The guy that uh, I was playing against, um, he was taking notes on how many times he claimed in a game. Illegal. Uh, he asked first. He asked permission, so can't, I gave. Can't be done. Nah, he was it's in the rules. It's should it I get... in the rules? All right, then I have a ga then I have a game win. I went three. You have a win. win. <laughs> no, but he asked permission. It didn't bother me any. He wasn't taking notes on the game. He was taking notes on claims. 
Nope. Mm. That's and, game uh, notes. Dude, it was just a store champion. It was it's in the games. rules. Whoa. <laughs> okay, I went three I went three two today. I went three two today. <laughs> <laughs> no, it, the reason I say that is it came up um uh, I went to a regional with Jerry and he was like, I want to start taking notes because I, I guess his was a little bit different, but he was like, he was playing Thrawn Tarkin. He's like, I'm going to write down what's in their hand. <laughs> and, yeah, no, uh, that's not allowed. He went up to the guy and he's like, hey, can I take notes while we play? And he's like, no, it's in the rules. You're not allowed to. And then he referenced the uh, the FFG like rules and such. And yeah, you can't take notes. No, I knew I knew game notes was not allowed, but... Oh my goodness! Um, it was. It was. He didn't do it actively. He did it at the end of the game with me. He didn't do it during the game, but um, he wanted to do it during the game, but forgot. Mm -hmm. Um, the big, his big play was I let him claim because I played Ri, and then um, uh, he just hyperspace jumped after a big turn, and then he quick drawed, quick drew, quick drew. That's the correct word for that. And rolled massive damage, and I was it was GG. But I am trying to look up uh, the verbiage on Bendu's Lair because with all the Rex that was around, somebody was playing Bendu's Lair today. So it says, "Power action: Roll this die into the pool. Mm -hmm. After you take control of this battlefield, remove this die." So that was the big question. It was if someone has Bendu's Lair, uh, the power action. Field. Yeah, and then yeah, the you claim it removes it. Right. That's well. No, it's a power action. It says yeah, but you can only use it roll. once. Yeah. So like, if they roll, if they use the power action, roll to die. Right. You claim. Now you're in control of the battlefield. You can't like do anything with it. Or if you use Rex's ability and gain control of the battlefield, right? Yeah. It can. removes the die from the field, but you can't use the power action again to reroll it because you can only use the power action once for that card. So basically, yeah, yeah, it diffuses yeah. the die when you whenever you use Rex's ability. So, like, if you play with Bendu's Lair and, and let's say you're playing it with a Rex build and your opponent tries to use it against you, you can use his ability to shut it down. But that would be, like, super late game scenario, you know? Right, right. <clears throat> the die sides on Bendu's Lair are pretty good, actually. Yeah, I, they're not bad. It's got a focus as well, which can be used. I feel like that has to be, like, your first action, and then you, like, <laughs> let it sit, and then you roll out a character, and then you immediately resolve it. Like, right. I don't... If it hits the the... Like the one range, the two disrupt the two. The two shields are nice. The two shields or the resource, just take it. I guess the focus is the only thing you have to wait until you had other dice in the pool. Um, but I don't know who Bendu is. Bendu, man, he is a beast. Amanda, who's Bendu? Oh, she's already typing it. I guarantee that. Yeah, <laughs> Bendu is awesome. Well, it's actually the Bendu. So like, it's like a race of like these neutral. Force characters. I actually just because I, I, I'm like the only person that's honest with the world and say that I can't sit through all of Clone Wars. Like it just bothers me sometimes. But he was in Rebels. Okay, I'm not. Says done. Amanda, Rebels season three. Yes. Um, but I figured out where like Dagger and Mortis and all came from, and that was a pretty cool like arc of the story. Like the. Uh, the light and the dark brother and sister or whatever they were. Yeah. The man is probably like, oh my God, how do you forget their names? Um, but I, I watch it with my sons and they, whenever I'm home, like, I'm just like, hey, put this on. Because my youngest son says Star Wars. Oh. Star Star Wars. <laughs> yeah, oh cute. my gosh. One yellow card. One yellow card and you got it. Now right, we're popping that. All right, what do you roll out here? Is there no mother? Be... Or is that mother? Oh. Yeah, I don't know. The father was like the force, and then they wanted Anakin to take over for the father because the father was dying, and Anakin's the chosen one. And it was some crazy thing. And then Ahsoka gets like possessed. It was wild. Hmm. I'll get there. I'll watch it all. It's really good. I've read like another chapter of um, Rebel Rising, so I was really happy with myself for that. Um, you know, it's sitting here just on my my desk, a um, fifty pages read of uh, Thrawn. 
and that's about all I'll get through because <laughs> that was quite boring. That's kind of how it was with Aftermath at first, and then once I kind of got through it a little bit, it was like, wow, this is it's pretty good. I also have what else is sitting down here? I also have um, Phasma that I want to try by Delilah Dawson, and then what else is under here? Um, that's about it. I just got some Stephen King books. I like a love hate relationship with Stephen King, but this is a well just King podcast. Watch him, dude. If you ever want to, I'm there with you. That Marco Polo video of Kevin explaining about the little people and like pulling about insomnia, yeah. yeah, and his neighborhood was like creepy. <laughs> like, dude, that book is awesome. It actually he bumps it. He lives in Derry, Maine, so he bumps into older versions of kids from it. Yeah, that's pretty like, crazy. Yeah. Hey, Benji, Sammy, we're doing good. I'm just sick. Uh -huh. Man, 11 people watching. Did you yeah. share this? I like yes, I did. Scrubs, yo. Oh, I, shared, I shared it in one place. I didn't share it in multiple places. Oh, Jesse's playing? Are you serious? No, he's not. Jesse's not playing. The one time I don't guess that he's playing, that'd be so funny. Um... I should probably should say in the Discord, like, hey y'all, we streaming. Oh, I could drop it in the Discord. That's easy. Yeah, you should. I should do. I actually lined it all up. I just didn't hit drop. I didn't just drop it in. Oh my goodness gracious! Look at this. I'm feeling lonely over here. Scared by f bombs. <laughs> We're not as family friendly as KOR. All right. <laughs> Teeny. Let's force him to put this in here. So, wait, is Jesse playing under Deadeye Archer? Is that what's going on? Maybe. Hey, Ashton, can you, have you can you go over and fix this Discord pile? It's just like shake it in the corner. Just highlight it and hit G. I got it. I'll do it. You keep playing. Thanks. She's twitching over there. No, don't leave, Jedi Geek Girl. She's appalled by us. She cannot believe that we have such potty mouths. <laughs> hey, here? Joe Rankin's here. What's up, Joe? What did I miss? That's a fun call. What did I miss? What did he oh, do? Oh, Amanda, before you leave, pretty sure he's Anakin. Use his special. Using Anakin's special. damage to uh, Mother Tal. Oh, that's Charlie. Okay, yeah, that is Charlie. All right, my turn now. Amanda, did 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 any of us win a comeback on your show? <laughs> I'm asking in a public forum. <laughs> She's like, not even one vote. <laughs> 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 oh hey and rubber rubber ducky cheeks is here so, Moss. who'd you get for who'd you get for a teacher rubber ducky who's your third grade teacher she's like mrs anderson and she, she sucks yo mrs anderson <laughs> is a fourth grade teacher <laughs> is she <really? laughs> unless she switched back to third grade <laughs> Hey, yeah, so I have some duplicates now, so. Zach did. Zach did. Who's Zach? Zach Bun. Oh, Zach Bun. Don't be Zach like that. Bond. He's cool. He, wa he, he wants us to come to, to uh, Covenant. Zach Bun, like Destiny Famous. Is that the. Is that the. 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 The, the Ray. Uh, the Ray guy? Oh my god, I can't remember the deck. Ray Han? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Welcome to Destiny, Kevin. What happened? <sighs> and it's Monk. Monk, what's up, man? <laughs> Monk's going to Covenant half a continent away. <laughs> uh, no, he went he went already. You already I went? I think he went. I was thinking it was this weekend, right, Monk? You went this weekend? Oh, you got Mrs. Crane? Okay. 
All right. Answer the question. What's my question? People getting held back. Um, teachers can teach different grades any year, dude. You should know, Joe Rankin. Um, I feel like Monk got starstruck when Zach Bunn reached out to him and said, "Hey, man, you should come to our event." And he was like, "How much?" <laughs> and then, no, I just, I just want to go. He said X like, amount of dollars. And yeah. Monk was like, "Hell yeah, <laughs> <laughs> sure." You go, you go, Kevin. You represent the Jackalman. I have to feed two children. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Come on, Question, Tom. Kevin. Did Ashton get you any wedding gifts? Ashton did get me a wedding gift. He got me this stream. I hooked this you up with some stuff. <laughs> what? <laughs> I, I hooked him up with my promo <laughs> flank and lightsaber pool. Oh, and some yeah. That's, tickets that's my birthday. At the Galactic Qualifiers. That's my birthday. What Galactic Qualifier? What? Oh, we didn't go goodness, to a Galactic Kevin. Qualifier. You dreamt that. This guy. It's on video. The Galactic Qualifier? Oh, yeah, it is. Hey, what's up, Sir Lone Star? <laughs> F. Mary Kill Ventress. Yeah, Ara where's uh... Phasma? I would marry Aura, F. Phasma, and I don't know who Ventress is. So. Yo, Kill you Ventress. got that all wrong. Dude. Ventress, she'd be that, she'd be that down, that down <laughs> chick. Ventress, you know what I'm saying? Uh, like Phasma, down, down syndrome? Down, no, like Good. she's she's down for anything. Oh, okay. I think I think Ventress is a freak in the sheets. Pretty oh cute. Oh my gosh, children. And then uh, Ray, you need guidance. It's called I D K, right? I yes, no, I don't know. I D K. Yeah, because you in the army. <laughs> Um, no, you marry Phasma because that's Bay. And then, what are you talking about? I have no idea. No, Phasma's I'm dead. Not... Well, Aura is dead too. No. Oh my goodness. You did... You're you're playing. Don't worry about anything. My yeah, turn. You can't, you, can't F, you can't F marry or kill anyone when you. I'm are... I'm like forgetting how to play this playing. game, trying to understand what you guys are saying right now. The Ask chat it. is more important than the gameplay. Don't Je you understand? <laughs> Amanda just asked us. Um. And no, she asked Kevin. Rubber Ducky, oh, yeah, what's she up? did ask Kevin. F, marry, kill. Ventress, Aura, or Phasma? F, marry. That's not polite. That's not polite. <laughs> That's not yeah. polite. What the hell is wrong with him? Everybody's like, we got a couple of comments on uh, on our mat. They like it. So. Oh, thank you. I put it together for I, the stream real quick. No, don't let Ashen fool you. I made it. So. I know. Yeah, this Kevin. time, it was truly me. So. Kevin, Kevin did it. <laughs> Oh man, I don't even know what I'm doing right now. It matches. It matches my. Uh, it's not mine. It's my wife's DS. I want to. Okay, it's purple space. Let's flank that. I wanna know what love is. Such a great song. I'm gonna start keeping clips like on like standby. Whatever we keep seeing these same songs. No. Uh, but as long as it's under three seconds, we don't get copywritten. Kevin, known for his tech skills. Yeah, I'm the tech guy. Thank God he left Dude, me I, alone. I, I, I'm the one with the with the the GoPro helmet. <laughs> oh Lord! Um, Dude, my webcam has worked in every stream, Joe Rankin. Where are you getting this from? Yeah, I'm the liability. Yeah, <laughs> we need Ray insurance. <laughs> yeah, we do. You ain't kidding. We're we're gonna go to Worlds. We're gonna get kicked out. We're gonna meet up with Joe and Chris, and it's gonna be a disaster. Amanda <laughs> keeps encouraging the um, naughty talk. Oh. Yeah, well, I mean, you started the stream with the biggest f bomb in Jackman history. <laughs> I started the stream talking to my buds, <laughs> but what she in said private. is, but what she said is really funny. Actually, if you read it, I think that's funny. <laughs> that was funny because it was like I don't know if we're live. Are we live? Because this is what Ashton always does. He goes, "We're live." And then, like, everyone... Ray, the joke's over like, with. It's dead. You ain't got to explain it again. All it right. is Ray's fault. It is dirty army mouth. Dirty, no, not. dirty army don't mouth. Drop, don't <laughs> drop the soap. Just eat it. <laughs> Just eat it. <laughs> Put on wood, you sloth. 
I don't even understand what I that almost is. approached Hyperloops at Gen Con, but my don't one you remember that video that you shared with us? The lovely army video. Joe, don't don't let them intimidate you, man. They're just guys. Mm -hmm. They're just dudes. What right. what did he say yeah, about dis Hyperloops? Disrupt this. He said he he almost approached Hyperloops, but he was he was shamed and he went and cried instead. They're really cool oh, guys. Joe. Yeah, they're actually Joe Rankin. Do, Joe Rankin, do you comment on their stuff as much as as much as you keep in contact with us? What is he doing with this card? Frost is the new curse word. <laughs> My brain is hurting. What's going on? Just he's like, discarding them. He's replacing? An no, he's discarding them to use Anakin's it's special. Special, Jeez. Okay, okay. But he clicked replace. Rivals, released in February. All right. I don't, I don't know what he's doing now. I'm sorry. What? Where's <laughs> maybe, my... he's, maybe he's hoping he can get an overwrite and the two damage. Okay. All right. Whatever. Um. Okay. Nah, I, that love, you. I love you, Charlie. Really great guy. Um, they probably even know you by name. Uh, freaking uh, Nick, little NJ Cuenca was asking me about my uh, my store champ uh today, and I thought that was real nice. He was like, "Hey, buddy, how'd you do today?" I, and even... I was like, "Well, let me tell you about something." Go for the gamble. Oh, Ray, I gotta tell you, um, the last time we streamed uh, after our last store championship, I actually went up to Paul and I apologized for making noise during his final. Did you really? <laughs> yeah, I did. I'm like, I'm Yo, sorry, man. story I mean, time with uh, Ray from Jackalman Games. This is funny. Hide your kids. So, hide your wife. So we're at Top Deck uh, in <coughs> Westmont, New Jersey. Kevin comes down to visit like me in my local area, which is like my area where I'm from when I'm not in the army. And he comes down. We're having a great time. We do the whole store championship. The Golden Dice guys are there. Our Brook Gaming guys are there. We're all having a good time. Well, they cut to the top four, and they're playing. And me and Kevin are like, hey, let's get a little side game in and just watch these guys play. Kevin is, like, making a lot of noise. <laughs> like, And we're playing the game of Destiny, and Kevin's, like, tapping on the tables. And laughing he, and yelling. He's laughing and yelling. And I was like, shut up, man. Like, can you just chill out? I'm thinking in my head, but I never told him because I wanted to, him to make himself into an ASS because we're a new censored podcast. So that's <laughs> See you later, Jedeki Grill. Have a great night. Thanks for joining us. Um, but yeah, it was no, the I, it was pretty I funny. Dis I discarded it with fill your anger, or I removed it. It was the heat of Kevin. Oh, so what? Finish that line. Uh, I don't know that song. But anyway, so I made a whole bunch of noise, and Paul from Arrowbrook turns and gives me this look. Of like, can you shut the fuck up? Oh, oh can wow. you shut the f up? Sorry. Jesus, Kevin, you guys made me feel bad. I and feel that terrible. Was... I'm gonna leave. Goodbye. Good night. <laughs> Kevin, you're not on the block. We're putting out a family-friendly program here. Oh God, he's gonna jump off the first story. See what happens God. when you get married? You become psycho. School teacher of children. Potty mouth. I know, man. Jeez. Hey, how'd Mr. Chip do, Ray? Um, Joe, <laughs> we'll just say his what win rhymes, came off of... What rhymes with zero and four? <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Uh, yeah, it was... Uh, his one win was a bye. So, I'm <laughs> sure he'll explain it. Oh, Kevin. Sorry. Go punch a pork. No, I put deodorant in my mouth. <laughs> so, uh, so he looks at me with this look of, can you please be quiet? <laughs> but the mean version. And I say, oh, sorry, and, and shut up. <laughs> so, he, he, um. He was being legit loud. Yeah, so today I went up to that same guy. He was at my, he was at this tournament. And I said, I just need to apologize for making a bunch of noise during your final. And he's like, oh, I don't even remember you doing that. <laughs> mm. And I'm like, sorry. I just, I felt bad. 
So <sighs> that was nice of you, Kev. Yeah, I didn't apologize to. I should have also apologized to Frenchie because he was the one he was playing against, and he was there too. Frenchie was stressing that day. He was. Uh, uh, he wanted to win so bad, and the mirror yeah. was scary. The mirror, but he won. He won a. He won another one. He went to a different yep. one and took it. Yeah, he's a good player. Um, Paul's Paul is nasty. The Arabrook Gaming guys are really good. Um, I do some play testing with Drew every once in a while, who goes under the name Original. They're very skilled players. I was playing him the other day, and I was playing the Talzin Mando Mando, and he was playing Afra Snoke Battle Droid. And it came down, like, it was a pretty close match, but um, he he basically, like, forced me into Force Illusioning the witch magic that I knew was on top of my deck. So it was pretty rough. Like, that's the type of stuff that they, they keep track of. Like, So if you want to be a good player, remember everything. <sighs> I'm, I feel really bad now. And if you want to learn how to win in Star Wars Destiny, watch our last video. Oh yeah, guys! Uh, for those of you that haven't watched it, it's a conversation with Andrew Cox. Spoiler. <laughs> yeah. Like we didn't really say that it's with the Gen Con first place winner, the North American Championship in the tagline, but kind of wanted to make it more fun than that. We're gonna have the, to. We're not getting the things. We're not getting the response you wanted. So go watch it. It's great. We're gonna have to uh, adjust the fun level on that one. Maybe. I mean, all of the tags, it, the hidden tags, the search, the search uh, stuff is is pretty decent. What's he doing? Force illusion. Oh, so he, he, was be he was trying to force illusion. Um... Three, but he could only force solution one because it's three separate packets of damage. So he, he takes two. New subscriber. Woo! John Schneider. Woo. Hi, John Schneider. Right, if you're so watching the three. stream, it's probably because we're saying F so much. Um, yeah. We're getting a whole new crowd. It's like a biker gang. All this <laughs> <thing>. <laughs> like, these guys are pretty cool. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, uh, I love you too, guys. I can just picture, um, like Pee Wee. Her I'm the Pee Wee Herman that like would walk outside and accidentally knock down all of the motorcycles. <laughs> <laughs> all right, what's up? Um, your turn. So. Life's pretty good. I was um, really hoping I wouldn't drop there, but I did. Oh, you're back. Hmm. Oh, hey, way to go, guys. Are you still doing Lego stuff? Oh, my turn. <laughs> did you guys read about the, what Joe Rankin said? Yeah, about Pee Wee Herman. Yeah. That, we can't what? talk about that on the stream. No, uh, the thing before <laughs> it. Going for the night crowd, oh late God. night oh, rambling. Wait, 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 I'm thinking. Drunken sailors. There goes, there goes Ashton. I'm trying. Sorry, to... boss. <laughs> like we'll try. This is the thing. We try to like provide commentary as one of us plays, but Ashton the whole time he plays like I don't know. I have this electroshock in my hand, and I think I might use it. <laughs> um, after that, I think the force wave is gonna go down. Pink for one, and then uh, I don't know what he's doing. And then he it's not. Have... It's not actually that. It's just, uh, Charlie's like doing things that isn't. Time for him to do. That's Charlie. Yeah, we saw we saw you your comment, Mister Outer Rim Cantina. Hey, that's Dan. Dan, who? It's Dan Solo. I'll tell you a little story. Oh, way nice. back, way way back in the day, meaning like the beginning of this year, um, me and Dan were gonna do content together. Um, he is from California. He's a great guy. He's got some kids, a wife, and he's just a really genuine dude. Speaking of wives, my wife is here. Hi, wife. Hi, wife. I don't know if anyone can see you. But you're um, here. Yes, they can see part of her. Oh, okay. Get out of the shot. <laughs> no, no, I don't mind her. In the, Start yelling at her. Shot. No, she's Tell great. Her the world can see her. The whole world can see you, Taryn. All 15 of them. 
Yeah, and and Logan. M right. Not not friend Logan, student Logan. The kimono. Yeah, man. Bye. Black belt. So is the stream fluent, guys? Because we're using a different type of video capture, so I'm wondering if it's slowed it down a bit. Because I noticed it on my end, so. Uh, did you ask if Terran's a, a black belt? Yeah, I, did. I like their outfit. Uh, Ter well, it's just a rope, but uh, Terran's working on um on some uh, kung fu stuff. Legit. She's got phoenix eye punches that hurt. And she kicked me in a sword once and gave me a big old bruise. <laughs> Wait, when you say me too, are you working on kung fu stuff? Oh yeah, you're doing karate now. Way to go, man. Man, we got this game has been going on for a while. Are we got? Are you got him yet, Ashton? Or are you just tinking away at him? I'm working on it. Finally, a roll or something. Oh, nice. All right, so that's two. All right, so many levels of wife lock. Okay. What? So you ha you had to go through like getting permission, and you had to go through making sure you have enough money to buy the tickets for the airplane. Then you had to make sure that there you had babysitters. I'm such an idiot. My my mic's been on mute for the last like two minutes, and I'm just sitting here talking to myself. And I'm like, why is everyone cutting me off? I'm starting to get really, <laughs> starting to get really annoyed. Oh, good catch, good catch, good catch. Oh, that's Claps. Funny. But I'm looking in the stream now, and I want like I, <laughs> I'm just sitting there talking to myself. <laughs> No, Ray, we wouldn't talk over you on purpose. That's that, leave that up to me. We like that too <laughs> much. We like you too much. Uh, okay. Who's winning? Right now, Ashton is winning because he has more health on his characters than Charlie. But they're both losing because everyone else is bored. Because I, I swear, so Lone Kevin Star, puts Lone like Star was saying that it doesn't uh, trigger its ability when you use Holocron. Why? It's still Is playing it a card equipment? from plan. No, it, it should. It should because it states that it says um, when you play an equipment or weapon from your hand, it deals one damage to a character. But it's a power action. Yeah, you can't do it multiple times in yeah, a turn. Switch an upgrade with blue ability. Upgrade in your hand. So you're switching. You're still playing. It's only triggered at one time. Whoa, mm -hmm. hold on. What's 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 he doing here? doesn't trigger on the upgrade. Yeah, yeah, he's right, because that's an ability. It triggers on the holocron, not the... Yeah, right. That. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so if you were thinking about, like, if you... Because you can't get the holocron off until you put the upgrade, so that's what I think he's clarifying. Uh, you might have... Did you put the holocron down this turn? So what I did is I... No, I, it was already on the field. So when I swapped yeah. out force throw... It doesn't ping, but then when I play Holocron, it pings. Yeah, so take that power action token off of them. No, I, I, I'm keeping it in place for the Holocron I just played earlier. See what I'm saying? Yeah, you played it earlier this round, the Holocron. Hello? No, Holocron was played last round. Okay, so how are, how are you getting the... Never mind. Because... Cause it... Alright, oh. so here's what I did. I had Holocron already on it, right? I activated, got the special... I swapped out Holocron with Force Throw, which doesn't yeah, you, which doesn't you ping, right? And then I took Holocron that when I went back to my hand, I played it again on him and pinged him for one. But the problem is, is I pinged it whenever um, whenever I switched out the upgrades, and that's why. And I shouldn't have. 
I should have pinged it after I played Holocron on him. Does that make sense? Yeah, sure. <laughs> He's such a punk. I just can't hop in the game. I feel like I'm stuck here. It was a he. My computer's acting stupid. Yeah, did everybody lag out with me? Oh, you're or right. Or is it me? Yeah, take one less, Charlie. Super Destiny. <sighs> I think okay. this is Dan's first uh, time hopping on with us. Yeah, welcome, Dan. How you doing? Dan, what is your favorite Italian dish? <laughs> Back in the day. Now, I've been asking every, every time I get into an Overwatch game, that's how I start every game. I ask my new team. What's your favorite Italian dish? And if nobody answers me, I'm like, okay, this is going to be a bad game. <laughs> <laughs> what does it mean when it says message retracted? Like they, they did not send it, but they deleted it. it. Yeah. And your brothers are flooding this. What is that? Man, like 15 of them. Let's see. Favorite lasagna with hot sauce. Wait a minute. What? That like makes it not lasagna anymore. It's, then like it's just that. spicy noodles. A Mexican Garfield. A <laughs> Mexican Garfield. <laughs> <laughs> More like a Texan Garfield. Joe, they like me in the Overwatch community. I think, you know what? I'm just going to go and do live streams. No, that's too much work. I need. <laughs> Did you see that guy? He like called you out in the comments. He's like, yo, 1v1 Overwatch. Who? I don't know. Some dude in our comments. I forget his name. Oh, yeah. I know what you're talking about. Um, what? On a YouTube yeah, video. He like posted yeah. something. What? Are you just going to keep saying what? 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 Hold on. I got to change accounts. I got to go find this message. On like your Let's Play, <laughs> one of your Let's Plays, the dude just straight up was like, play me in Overwatch, punk. What? Oh my gosh. He didn't say punk. I just added that part. Oh, like okay. He should have. So, no. Pizza is an Italian dish. Is that your brother's? Sorry, it is an Italian dish. So he's solving. What just happened? Yes. How Was many he resolving you... this? Or three? How many... <clears throat> okay. No mercy is a ridiculous card. They should reprint. All right. Um. <laughs> Look at Monk, you sleaze. <laughs> Monk, hey, out of rim, we should do a <laughs> Padawan story. Wait, what? <laughs> Sniping people. Yo, you got some hate on one of your Rolling Thunder that the mod is the mod is ugly. Yeah, I, I kindly said thank you, sir, and things like of that sort. Nah, I explained to him. Oh that yeah, one v one me on, one v one me on Overwatch yeah. by the Luxman. That's such a gamer thing to say. One v one. Yeah, one v one me, man. I'm gonna try to start beating people up as an adult and just say one v one v one me, man. That's what I'm gonna do. Oh, you better pop that force illusion. Yes. So he's gonna block two or one. He's comment on a couple of things. <laughs> Monk. Okay. Bust. Okay. <laughs> he said busted. Okay. Then he's, he's Monk here, might so. be the nicest guy I think I've ever met. Yeah, he is a nice guy. Yeah, but he's so nice that he hasn't invited me to a Padawan story yet. So whatever. Damn. Ooh. <laughs> Man, shots fired. Shots fired. <laughs> yeah, welcome to the Shots Fired podcast. <laughs> My name is Mike. Bobby Sapphire. <laughs> <laughs> he's such a cool dude too yeah he's pretty down to earth Mike Gem's the Brad Pitt of Destiny <laughs> <laughs> Mike 
Joe, Joe Colon's The Rock. Who else? Check your darn disc. Kevin's Pee Wee Herman. <laughs> Check your damn disc. <laughs> I'm the John Cena. I know. You guys didn't have to say it. I knew. John wait, wait, Cena. Monk. Are we going to make my Padawan story ba, da, 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 da. the Elite gameplay? Was that what we were going to do and then we totally didn't do it? What? What did you not do? Hold on. I'm checking my darn Discord. I'm going to go ahead and... Uh... Hmm. Case we're gonna discard this. I don't have any private messages from Monk recently, so I feel like I should just like spoil a little bit of things because I feel real excited about this team that we've started. Um, sure, spoil too, some stuff. Too, too early. Too early. We already got a win underneath our belt. Oh wow! Because of my that. boy. Yeah, it's Fortune. <coughs> yeah, Fortune's awesome. With his cat Snoke. He's so, been with us since the beginning. What? Here, Fortune's here a, at, what? Here at Jackalman, uh, we decided we wanted to get a team together of players that both we liked and thought were uh, were pretty decent, or or at least amongst the same like <laughs> playing field. What the fuck are you laughing about? I'm laughing at Monk just sent me a message. Hey, would you uh, like to do a Padawan story? <laughs> <yeah>. <laughs> Continue with your story. Say no. Uh, too late. So we reached out to like a bunch of guys, and we have like a, a team of six um, that I think we went back and forth with names because we have some other content creators in there. So uh, Monk being included, but um, so I think this is like I just I keep changing the name every single day, but I think pack. the pack. I think the pack is cool, um, and I'm gonna make some pack T-shirts. I'm gonna get it's gonna be cool. It's like official team T-shirts. All right, we're, not, we're being good now. We're not. We're not saying any bad words. So, is there a way I can check members? Let's see. Members. Oh, dude, this is a pretty good lineup. Of what? Of our of, for the pack. Should I just read them off? Or should I not? No. No. Okay. They'll, they'll know. Because the we don't, we don't. Are. Yeah, we don't want people to know that if they're not part of the pack, that they're inadequate. It's not that. It's no, that. it's totally that. No, it's not. It's that there's people that we're <laughs> we know more or we're closer to. Uh, check <laughs> check I your Facebook messages to be jerks. every day. Just want to let just want to let you know that well, I'm really not uh, in there. I think I, don't play I think our anymore, cap. Apparently. I think our cap should be ten people in the pack. So for the Jackman pack, I think once ten spots is filled, it's just. There. I don't think we need to fill it up larger than that. Okay. Because then it's going to get too flooded. And then it becomes a Discord. And I, I, you know, Discord's great and all, but as you guys know, like I'm too busy to be able to keep track with all this Discord stuff. So show Frey hates women? What? What happened? Show. I can't read all names to show. Ray hates what? women since they talked in a group of guys. Some people. What? Joe, watch yourself. Private intel. The pack knows and can't read all names to show. Ray hates women since he talked to a group of guys. What? What is what? Guys, guys is guys is for everybody. Yeah. I, it, well, where is Joe from? Oh, he's from Iowa. Right, Iowa has no culture in the sense of we from Philadelphia. Everyone is used guys. For real. Yeah, you don't know who we got in there. It's it's Kevin's in there. There's one. <laughs> Screw you. <laughs> What's happening? Uh, you got yelled at or being yeah, Joe, Yeah, Joe Rankin. Guys is not universal. Uh -oh. I'm from Iowa. We have no culture. I agree. Um, yeah, I know some guys from Iowa. And uh, yeah, use guys is everyone. I've been told that my whole life as far as like, I'll Holy be like, yeah, cow. hey, how, how you guys doing? And they're like, um, excuse me, uh, there's girls here too? People don't say that. Yes, they do. How you guys doing? That's everybody. 
Yeah, that's that's crazy. People are getting like that. Anyways, this took a turn for the sadness. <laughs> let's, let's, uh, let's, uh, let's, let's, let's like crank this up. Uh, you're about to get wrecked with this. Yeah, this deck's good. Actually, gonna keep um, this. Man, oh, Joe Rankin said that kind of talk gets you sued. Is this hired gun? Yes. Are you playing? Who are you playing against, Sir Lone Star? Let's go, Lone Star. I mean, Ashton. I mean, Sir Lone Star. I mean, Ashton. What's he playing? Oh, this is the sneak. It's a vehicles deck, Ashton. Yeah. Better watch yourself. Mm. Better win this roll off, too. <laughs> you have the picture NWO. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the New World Order, the Wolf Pack, yo. <laughs> <laughs> no, but for real. So here's one. We were talking about shirts earlier. I'm kind of catching up to the conversation, but yeah, yeah. So we, we talked we should, to this I, guy named Nick. I yeah. did want to make pack shirts. I thought would be pretty cool. So they'd be like us, the Jackalmen. I say just say Jackalmen in the back, and then we make pack shirts with like numbers or something fun. Um. So anyway. Yep. I think that'll be name next. The pack. Uh, where is this message of us? Oh, there you go. Yo, check your Facebook messages. I'm sending you a secret one. Mm. Okay. And that is spelled, I spelled that right. Okay, back to the stream. So, Ashton, how do you feel? I don't know if we talked about this, but how do you feel of of changing Mother Talzin to Piet? I think it's a great idea. Not a bad idea. I feel, I don't know, Red Yellow Villain is super solid. The only thing that's holding me up is you don't have access to things like, like effectively things like uh, Force Illusion, Witch Magic, um, and things of that nature. And the holocron suites and everything like that but today the, the the version i saw you have access to like zero cost mitigation um he doesn't like use and things like that and then you flood the listen to the tech that this kid was playing he was playing that equipment that costs zero ashton and it increases the value of your character's health by one that's pretty good mm -hmm. yes um, he was playing dh 17s to flood the board with uh Cheap costing things. He played E eleven blasters because uh Piet Piet has the has indirect uh, indirect sides. And he has the focus and then he focuses everybody else's stuff. So it's really good. Also, um some things of a list that just got sent to us. Uh you get access to your technical mastery and you get one best defense. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, you try that you out. can also do the speeder bike too if you if you really want to make them fast. Mm -hmm. Speeder bike lets you resolve another dice after you resolve it, right? Yes, another one of the characters, like a, another one of the dice. I think it's upgrade or character dice. Um, okay, but it's it's a bunch of focus sides, so you just focus to damage and then resolve it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's pretty sweet. Um. And uh, I was thinking about why wouldn't you just add in freaking um, pod racers too? The single dot, uh, the uh, uh, one oh, resource. Bullets? No, the oh, one no, no. resource. Gray, pod? gray ones. Yeah. Mm -hmm. If they get bounced back to your hand, you just freaking uh, pitch them to reroll. But yeah, I think Adam it's pretty Hoffman vehicle deck across from him. It's Rex hired gun um, clone trooper, and it's pretty nasty in yep. theory. Oh, wow. Nice. Triple threat. 
Ashton, who are you going after? <coughs> Rex. Yes. Also, okay. what's what's? Can you remind me of what recon is, everybody? Because Donnie M is saying that you get tactical mastery and re recon. You guys know? To saying it right now is turn it uh, recons pay one turn a die to um, a symbol showing like somewhere else. So you can blank something. You can basically focus for one, but it, the symbol has to be showing on another die. Yours or your opponent's. Oh, 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 okay, okay, okay. I see it. Oh. So, uh, Charlie's asking you if you're going to be going to um, the store championship tomorrow. Uh, Ashton. Uh, no, I'm not. Okay. So, Charlie, no, he's not. <laughs> Wait, what? Um, so why did you get out? Okay. Hmm. Yo. What the heck is going on with this? Okay. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. So what's new, guys? Oh man. No, nothing. It's nothing's going on with me right now. I'm Sorry, I'm just I'm just trying to play legit because it's a legit deck here. <laughs> Go for it, Ash. No offense, Charlie. Like vehicles is like. <laughs> it's his turn. Uh-oh. Is that me that died? Or is that Ray? That was Ray. <laughs> yeah, my face is really big. <laughs> Ray oh, needs to come happened? back. Ray. Ray needs to come back. I'm huge. I'm this big monster. <laughs> Rah.
playing Darth Vader with Price and use Recon for Sith Holocron. Or Darth. And four speed. Yeah, I can see how that's pretty sneaky. Also, sorry for my monster head. It just happens when when Ray leaves the call. And he's probably restarting his computer right now. It probably would be better if I just put my head out of the screen. Or cover cover my picture up. Ray and all of his crazy technology problems. Yeah. I'm surprised he even knows how to use like Discord at all. Or Skype. Or any kind of like <laughs> Yeah. I'm just gonna cover my I'm just gonna have my thumb over this. It's a miracle he knows how to use TTS. Oh he's back. So it might be okay. Is he back? Can you see me? No. Uh Tommy, can you hear me? Can you can you hear me? We can hear you, yeah. No. Oh. Okay. My Dude, computer did I... that thing that crapped. See you guys later. This... Bye, good night. Good night. We're leaving? Good night. <laughs> Dude, I was always better at Ray than Ray at, at technology stuff. What happened? Are we done? No, we're not done. <laughs> oh. Bless you. Sorry, guys. Man, my my vape is like dying on me. I'm trying to get into this thing. <sighs> You're not better than me in technology. Yeah, there he is. That's a lie. You can see me now. There you go. Dude, what are we doing? We just sitting here breathing next to each other? Yeah, we're what's... just sitting and breathing because we're waiting for you to come back. And Ash is actually like try harding right now. <laughs> try try harding. harding right now. <laughs> so just like let him try hard. That's my favorite phrase. I and, love when people say that. And and I'm <laughs> and I'm in the middle of trying to uh, to recruit some people for some stuff. <sighs> oh, Chrome didn't shut down correctly. Well, if this computer wasn't such a piece of crap. Nope. Is this how the Civil War started? People breathing at each other? <laughs> <laughs> I think it was a little bit more in depth than that, Mr. Rankin. Joe Rankin's in rare form tonight. <laughs> <laughs> he, came, he came at me. <laughs> it's because he was the summer off. He's going a little... He's got that hobo life. Hobo life. Hobo life. Yo, way to kill Rex. I feel like I left and now I came back and Rex is dead. Boom, boom. Dude, Joe Rankin's hating on me tonight. He even made fun no. of my te my tech uh, problems. Everyone knows we're not supposed to talk about that. <laughs> it's like it is an, un it is, <laughs> the unwritten rule. It is, in fact, hobo days. Man, it's like having a summer off as a teacher is secretly like the best and worst thing. It's like you get really fat and <laughs> you have too much fun. And then you have to go back to work. <laughs> Crash landing. That's a good card. Yo, what's the price of sound the alarms right now? Because they were like at thirteen dollars yeah. at one point. And they went to like eleven. I wanna know how much they cost like right now. Sound the alarm, Star Wars, Destiny.
Can you hear me? Yes, we can hear you. Wow, I completely my internet completely dropped off again. Dang. Because I'm pretty sure I said like, "Hey, family alarms are still seven dollars," and Kevin's still just sitting there with that stupid face. You're never off work. A teacher is always a teacher, no matter what season or summer it is. But hey, yeah, hey, Ray, triple yes. set. It's it, you play as much as you can, right? If it says three characters, if there's only two character out, you can still play it. Uh, you have to. Well, you could use their dice and your dice. You could focus your dice and switch pot, switch theirs. Yeah, but what I'm saying is, is, does there have to be three character dice if there's only yeah. two on the field? Yep, it doesn't say. Oh, up to. I didn't know that. Okay, you're right. Yep, you're right. Nice. Okay, then I'm just gonna activate. You're right. What Best Buy is Best Buy going out of business? What? No way. Because like the best buy, the best buys near me are closing. Maybe they're changing their name to OK Buy. <laughs> <laughs> Middle of the road buy. That was. Anytime I go there, I'm always like. <laughs> <laughs> mm. I don't know. He just started glitching out. <laughs> I have no idea. What... I he hope started, everybody he just started heard sounding that. retarded. <laughs> <laughs> He's frozen in the stream I'm... too. My back? <laughs> oh goodness gracious! You might be back. Am I back? You're, uh, you are back. Yes. Okay. Dude, it's going. It's go skitzing it. like crazy right now. Are you in the? Are you in the game with them? No. You guys are assholes when you don't tell me that the fucking screen freezes. No, no, I, Kevin laughs out loud. It's so funny. Yeah. It's sad. I mean, like, with Toys R Us going out of business, and Babies R Us, too. Just like... <laughs> Just like, where are the babies going to shop? <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> no, or to, or to quote your to quote your niece, Amazon... What, what did she say in that video that was so funny? Target and Walmart. Target and Walmart only have enough money to stay open. Yeah, nobody else. My So, my... Uh, she's my second cousin. My second cousin was on, like, the... Uh, the news because she was having like a meltdown. So my cousin told her, which is her mother told her like, Hey, listen, Toys R Us is going out of business. And she's like, that's my favorite store. And she was like crying and she made it on the news. She like had a complete meltdown. It was, it, but it's like the most articulate meltdown. Yeah. Uh, how old is she? Five, six. Yeah. She's five. She's a pretty smart girl. Yeah. That's awesome. She makes me regret having boys every single day. <laughs> Yeah, it's like, it's like say Star Wars, Star Wars. Can you can you please pronounce the W? <laughs> Wolf. <laughs> I have this constant fight with my son because he can't say V right. He says everything sounds like a B, so he has like baby talk still. But like me and him get into arguments. I was like, "What's that across the street?" He's like, a, "It's a ban." I'm like, "No, it's, <laughs> it's a it's a van." Oh my gosh! Look at these rolls, dude. You might have killed Rex, but you still have four ships to fight. So, actually, yeah, this is actually a good question to ask. Who has a heavier New Jersey accent? Is it Ray or me? I want to ask. Because Joe Rankin will be all over that. <laughs> I but that's the thing if you because you're from Northern Jersey, like I'm from like the Philadelphia area. I don't think it makes a difference because my mom my mom's got that awe difference. and I and I don't have the awe sound. I don't think it I makes do. A, well, that's the thing. Like, the, but see, you're not that the the awe isn't 
That's there's New York accents, which I could pick out like from a mile away, and then there's Philadelphia accents. And I feel like you're not um, equipped to make the the difference in tones, and you just think no. Oh. Yeah, well, I like where did you grow up? I grew up. You came to where I grew up, man. Yeah, that was that place didn't have any culture either. What are you talking about? <laughs> it's just a bunch of white people. <laughs> uh, I had like a couple of Asian students in my in my grade, a couple of his, um, Spanish, one African American, and then everybody else <laughs> white. <laughs> I feel like you, <laughs> you made it really racist ghost noise. <laughs> yeah, but you know what? <laughs> That's us. Uh, mm. That sucks. They the are, sound, I know. The sound that Cool Whip makes when it comes out. Cool Whip. <laughs> cool Whip. Cool Whip. <laughs> you know, teaching... Ready Whip, does, Ready Whip doesn't so have an funny. H in it. Did you ever notice that? Ready Whip, the <laughs> that stuff doesn't have, a, doesn't have an H in Whip. Uh running too many even. Oh man, that stream's lagging behind. That's fine. I've already won. So we need a we need somebody else to play? No, I'm just kidding. It's still going on. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> cool whip. Why so serious? I mean, most of the people that live in my neighborhood go and work in uh, in New York City. Oh, I'll show that. It gave me like this thing. It, uh, Joe Rankin said, "You all sound like filthy animals to me," and it said, "Hide or show." Are you uh, watching from? Me. Are you watching from Jackalman? Uh, no. Nope. I'm in a different account. Oh, okay. Yep. Yep. Yes, I am. Completely different account. Sounds like a lie. Mm. It's, just, it's similar to when Ashton says everything's fine. <laughs> <laughs> now we have 15 people watching. <laughs> That's weird. Uh, big shout out to the guy who just joined. Really appreciate your support. <laughs> That's terrible. <laughs> he I, says everyone, to himself. Everyone watching, I apologize for these guys. They're, they're typically what, what they need to be tamed in there. Just being rude. Are what? you also calling us filthy animals? Are two? It's two different people calling yes, me a filthy you animal even today. You have to ask me the question. Ashton. Oh man, I just got to do four more. You know, I don't think I'm gonna be able to make you know, it. Karen regularly looks at at houses in Florida, right? Because she wants to meet and hang out with you. Really? Oh, that's so sweet. Yeah. She also wants to meet and hang out with Ray. Don't worry about it, Ray. Don't be sad. I wouldn't want to hang out with me either. Oh. Is a freaking should we, should we tell people about the skill? Or should What's we keep that at it? The skill. The, the, no, not skill. Scale. S-C-A-L. I don't know where this is going, so maybe you should <laughs> tell people. Okay. The, the, the two on a scale of... Oh, the jerk? Ten. Yeah, the jerk scale. Yeah, why would that make me upset? I don't know. I'm trying to be sensitive. Yeah, over. I'm trying sensitive. not to be a filthy animal. Oh, okay. See? I'm trying to rally up to say something. No, nah, man. I don't, I'm not trying to show you these hands. Because oh, here they you? are, right here. <laughs> hey, we <laughs> learned that all. <laughs> <laughs> Jacqueline Games, quality content. Hopefully people are laughing. Who's got the squeaky chair now? Yeah, I was it's just about me. to say, who's got it's the squeaky, squeaky chair? chair? I'm just trying to see see something, but I can't. Ashton, I was going to say the same thing. <laughs> it's like that right? last squeak set us off. Yo, who's got the squeaky chair? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, squeak, squeak. Who got it? Squeak, squeak. 
<laughs> yeah, because me, me and Ashton were squeak, doing a squeak, Let's Richie. Talk recording, and he's like, you see, the thing about it is squeak, squeak, squeak. <laughs> and I was like, Ashton, stop. What's with the noise? Ew, who's drinking like that? That's freaking Kevin. Oh, my God. Yo, my mic picked disgusting. it up so much. Oh, my God. I'm embarrassed. Dude. I'm going to mute my mic. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't know my mic would pick that up. Oh, I was really thirsty. I'm sorry. Appalling. I was so thirsty. I'm drying up in here. It's so hot. With this light on me. I apologize. Dude, those arc fighters hmm. they were jamming, jamming for me all day. 50% damage sides. Yeah, they're awesome. <laughs> Joe Rankin. Summer finally gave me the time to use the old WD-40. Are you yelling at my squeaky chair? Is that what you're laughing yeah. at? <sighs> Yo, I'll, I can switch chairs if you want. Here, I'm going to mute my mic and I'm going to switch chairs and see if it's less squeaky. Do, 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 do. So Mr. Chip was like live streaming my last game. I don't know where he sent it to though. You talking about me? No, I was saying uh, Chip like live streamed my last game against his buddy Zach, and I don't yeah. know where where he put it. He said it was Twitch. That's a thing, right? Yeah. Twitch. Is that oh, free? Oh, this chair doesn't squeak. Do oh. I have to buy this? No, it's free. It's oh, free. nice. Discard to reroll. This chair is super good. Ashton, have you won yet, man? Come on. Mm, it's tough. Whoa, this is loud. Okay. So do I just type in the person's name? <clears throat> yeah, I type discard to reroll. Nothing came up. Channels one. Oh, yeah, discard to reroll. Mm, this really sucks, man. <sighs> I have to wait for that. Wait for that. The chance. Is, what do I do? Do I play this? It's a question. Wait, wait. Lone Star, don't don't feel sad. I'm rooting for you. Let's let's go for it. Let's freaking go for it. I'm gonna lose because of this. That card's on your table, dude. You're showing him your flank. Eh. <laughs> <laughs> it's the last thing he's gonna activate anyway, so it's not a big deal. It's not gonna do me any good. <laughs> the flank's just chilling there. Now you guys are revealing my hand. Same with van braces. What the heck happened here? I don't know, but you just had him chilling there, like sitting on the side, like your one arm on in the game. It's because you have the a it's because you have the H button on. That's why. Oh, okay. Hold on, hold on. Let's restart this. Freaking TTS, man. All right, this is going it's back. It's the worst. None really of these is. things happen in real life. You know, the worst thing that happens to you in real life is when the, just the dice fall on the ground. And then you have to be like, excuse me, sorry. Can you help me out? <laughs> it's underneath your left foot. No, <laughs> your other left. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> then it's just a bunch of guys with big bellies looking on the ground. <laughs> They're like, oh, I got it. Oh. Uh, that's annoying. We, man, we should do a series of like annoying things in Destiny. It has to be for me um, when I roll and then it like the clanking against my my <laughs> tokens. I don't know why it bothers me. Oh, uh, I hate gently grazing another dice while you go pick up something up with like your pinky and you change the side and no one remembers what it is. Yeah, it's like, or you remember that? and you're like, I swear, I listened. To it. It, was, it was. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and and then the joke that everybody makes when it lands on the ground 
know, if it's a blank, it stays. That joke makes me yeah. so mad. Yeah. Such a bad joke. That's, that's a fair assessment. It is a bad joke. Way to turn off your flank, <laughs> homie. Nah, he's not going to activate him. No, he won. No. Not when you dropped him on the ground there. <laughs> Yo, discard to reroll all of it for the win. Oh, yeah, that's exactly what I'm going to try to shoot for. Oh, he's not doing that? Okay. Sorry, we're, we're watching this stream. We're not watching it live. Yeah, I can I tell. Could watch, I could watch it live. Oh. Thanks for your oh. support, guys. We're watching the stream. It's been a freaking nerve-wracking game. Um, That's our boy. Now let's call... Um... Oh, jam. Boom. Shoot. All he's got to do is do two damage. <laughs> it's like... Uh... Uh, and all I have to do to him is two damage. Well, here it goes. Come on, roll that two for the game. Come on, baby. Nope. <laughs> There's only one. Wait, hold on. I'm so confused now. Ah, uh, you. Stupid. Was she was she showing eight on the screen? Yeah, she was. Yeah, she was. Dang it! I did roll it though. <laughs> <laughs> the last card, man. <laughs> I did get it, guys. Uh... Tony vehicles is nasty, bro. So here's my hang up with the the Towsing Mando Mando deck, right? So with vehicles being like probably the most represented type of um archetype if you want to say or whatever i hate when people say archetype but uh archetype um right now that the taos and commando deck unless they have like a hero vehicle deck that have a bunch of like seven or even six character health like it's really hard to keep up with them because you're pinging you're pinging you're shooting someone here and there but then the, like by turn two if you haven't killed like two other characters then the, they're gonna start ramping up on these upgrade on these vehicles and that was like my last minute call was like, you know what? Towson Mando Mando, like, I don't think can compete with vehicles. Yeah, that's the thing. It's like, I'm going to try one more time. I'm going to try something different. But still, it's like, it's too hard. Like, that's a problem. Like, my matchup against vehicles, I'm just going to win or I'm just going to lose. <clears throat> it has to be solid. I have to tech something against it. The only thing I can think about teching against it is like another four solution or something, but... It's I don't know. What you... Yeah, I know that's. Tech. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. Like that's where, um, to be honest with you, like the the Piet build or Piet, whatever the hell his name is, um, might actually be better because then you could throw rocket launchers in there, and then focus, um, you know, you know, all your dice consistently, keep pinging here and there, um, and then. You uh, you have access to red, which gives you access to rocket launchers. Which if you can hit Piet's focus or Piet's focus or whatever, then you um, you turn to the special and just get rid of a a um, freaking vehicle. But no, it's it's a tall order. I mean, vehicles just might be the way to go. I'm telling you, bro. Like. Um, let me play you with the with that uh yeah the towels the uh snoke deck it's pretty nasty like it doesn't matter how much you kill my characters unless i have like one health left like i'm probably gonna have ramped enough because i like, got this like this build with the rex and stuff like they'll struggle to get to um Oh, he claims his. They'll yeah. struggle to get their resources here and there. Um, the way that they're doing it is by making everything cheaper with Rex's right. ability. Um, but the the Snoke deck, like I can consistently drop two vehicles a turn. Vehicle. 
And yeah, against that R2P2 today, I couldn't find some vehicles. I was like, what the hell? Because I'm running a lot of vehicles in that deck. And um, I couldn't find them. And then um, I was rolling like really poorly. And uh, everything started snowballing. He went through Snoke like really fast. Cause... I do I do really like what, what, what Andrew what? Fax was telling us. I'm sorry, I didn't want to jump I'm just in. kidding. No, I just um, was messing with you. Where he said, like, you just have to pick one archetype, <laughs> archetype that is, uh, that you want to be your bad matchup and just then put, make card choices that handle it to make, make you, uh, grind it out. I agree, like, and I'm not going to disagree with the guy because he's, you know, he's a champion and I'm not. But the only one thing I would say is if that's the most saturated, and I'm sure he just didn't say this, but if that's the most saturated, um, archetype i feel like you you have to get off the deck then you know what i'm saying right so like you can't just be like okay against the field of vehicles i'm gonna take a loss because that is i will say right now like 50 to 55 percent of what you're gonna be playing against uh yeah i mean I... like as much as people are like oh everything is so diverse and everything like everybody plays vehicles right now and there's there's hero vehicles there's villain vehicles but see there's... that's the way this game's going though like they're doing more and more with vehicles like you're gonna have to start having vehicles i think yeah i think just characters and upgrades just aren't gonna be enough there has to be some additional die support more die saturation somehow It's just that the good thing about them is they don't go away. Like you, li you have to tech in cards specifically for them, um, to go away. And then there's cards like reconstructed where you can just go pick up the, the card out of your graveyard. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's why they're so strong. As long as you can have, build some like little meat shields there. That's why I don't know if you guys saw that list I was putting together with, um, with uh, what was it? Hold on. Um, man, did my computer, my thing screen? You're still talking to us. Um, single die Anakin, single die rookie pilot, and two partisans. So it's a total of 30 health. Mm -hmm. and, and then I'm going to jam diplomatic protections in there, which is the one cost upgrade you put on them. Oh, yeah, I love that card. Yeah, so if you kill one of my characters, like an Anakin or a rookie pilot, you're back up to to 29 health i think that's ridiculous um you know with the shields that are, that'll be on them um you could probably throw a couple second chances in there to make your whoa to make your two yellow characters like or your three yellow characters really hard to kill um i just think that that could be a good deck and then you just you fill it with anakin's pod racer regular pod racers and you fill it with um ammo reserve so it, it gets the mill uh, vehicle train going on and then i would fill it with a bunch of two cost vehicles and then just jam out doing mix and match damage oh dude ralph prippenstein pripstein good old ralph what up ralph <laughs> He goes, I'm late. <laughs> Ralph, what's <laughs> up, man? Prippenstein, it's... Oh, my gosh. Got a lot of cards in your hand there, Ashton. What was your record, Mr. Ralph? Was it better than 2-3 or 3-2? Oh my gosh! Yeah, I could, I, I could have, but I'm gonna get it with my die, so don't worry. I would, I would have went home, Ralph. That's rough. He got launch bait twice, two rounds in a row. That's what? That's tough. That's rage inducing. I feel bad. Did you guys hear uh, Joe Rankin about the launch bay deck and why it like didn't go any further? It was seven and one going into day two or whatever. Wow. And the reason why it didn't get to go any further was they were like ready to start the best of threes and they were like all set up and it was against the Talzin Mando Mando. 
Um, and they were all set up, and the guy d- dug in his bag, and he left <laughs> his tech at, at his hotel. Are you serious? Yes. So he th- so the judge ruling was um, if he could produce a deck within the fir- within ten minutes, then they'll, they'll allow them build, to play. Build destroy, on. baby. <laughs> yeah, build build destroy. Oh, <laughs> if yeah, if if he can grab his deck or his deck can get to him in ten minutes, then um, then they would allow him to play. So he was texting like his buddy that he came with that was like in the Airbnb or in the hotel. And his buddy couldn't get there in ten minutes, so they, like, gave the win to, uh, to the Talzin deck. Oh, that's so lame. Yeah. So, like, Launch Bay probably could have went further. Oh. And I kind of almost wish it did, because then something would happen to Launch Bay. Because that's not how they want the game to be. Like, I draw everything and then kill you with Salvo. And it's not like like the only thing that can really like kill the launch bay is a five die villain start with vandalize. Like okay, I vandalize your launch bay, and then they just get right back. Like they could play cheat and grab it back, um, which cheats any card in your discard. So there's ways to to bring it bring it back with you. Oh my gosh, Salvo is ridiculous. That's that's Launch Bay's uh, one turn kill, Wincon. Is oh Salvo. My gosh. Because they'll, they'll be like, I have 13 cards in my hand, 13 to all of your characters. Oh my gosh. That deck is stupid. I want to build it. <laughs> I was playing it. Uh, Mr. Chip's friend Zach was playing it today, like uh, just as fun for fun. And there was like a six year old kid behind him um, who I've seen at like a ton of events. And he was like, You're playing this wrong. You should get rid of this. Is what the kid said to him. Because uh, Zach was like, This is the first time I'm really playing this deck. And he's like this big, nice guy. Um, and this kid, like standing next to him, giving him coaching lessons. And the kid goes, And when he finishes and Zach wins, he goes, Yeah, you should probably get rid of like 20 cards in that deck. <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> the kid was like eight eight years old, and he was telling him like what to play. He was telling Zach, or he was telling Chip. No, uh, no, Zach was playing the the launch bay deck, and the kid was standing behind him and the whole time. He's like, "You should probably play this next. You should play that, and then play this card." And then Zach was like, "All right, I I get it. I know." <laughs> and then and then the kid was like, "All right, I'm just trying to help you." And it was kind of funny. And then um, the kid. Zach wins, and the and the kid goes, "My launch bay deck's better, and you should probably change out about twenty cards in that deck." You guys ever had a grilled watermelon? Uh, no. Oh, I saw that video though. Yeah, that's what I just saw. Cause I saw yeah, them. Yeah, come... it looks like meat. Yeah, I didn't notice that it smoked watermelon. I didn't realize it was a watermelon until halfway through the video, cause I caught like it as it was rolling through, and I'm like, ew, that meat looks raw. But. That's, I guess, pretty cool. All of that. Do you want to be able to keep up, he says. I mean, three, five, six, seven. All right, sir, let's start. Don't go easy on me. I need practice for real against vehicles. <laughs> Okay. All right. Thanks for the game. All right, guys. Well, that has been me playing this deck and trying to trying to definitely get used to this and trying different ideas. Uh, we're going to cut this at 12 o'clock, right, guys? Well, yeah, it's 11.58. Yep. So. All right. So, um, man, you know, I don't know what to do with this deck. Uh, my store championship is coming up next weekend. 
So I'm going to be working with Kevin and Ray trying to get this figured out and figure out what I'm going to run. It's either going to be this or something else. Um, so anyway, if you guys have any advice for us, definitely make sure you leave some comments. Hit us up on Facebook, something, and uh, see what we can do. Let me know what you think. So it's, it's, it's a good deck, but I definitely need to go against vehicles more. So, But Sir Lone Star, thanks again, man. You've been a great support through all this, and we really appreciate it, dude. Thanks yeah. for watching, guys. Terrible outro. Love you. <laughs> no, I'm so, sorry. People sorry, saying, Ray, people Ray's always like. In our, in yeah. our messages, people are saying that I'm too young Kevin to be watching all of it. Yeah. I am not a robot. You're a robot. <laughs> sorry for the um, unsavory language in the beginning. Yeah. He is, he is very apologetic. Action you, you is hear not, the sincerity uh, in his voice. <laughs> I'm just, just doing it so I don't get fined. <laughs> Ashton is not uh, very forthcoming when uh, letting me know that I'm um, on live stream. It's probably one of my biggest fears because my, like my bedroom, um, my bathroom, my master bathroom is right over there. And sometimes I come out of here naked and I wonder <laughs> if like I'm being live streamed because my camera will be on and I oh, have to man. set my camera up. It's a big we're just, fear. Mark. We're just gonna keep the we're just gonna keep the uh, the live stream going at all times. Just make Ray pretend that it's not going on. Like the probably. Truman Show, but the Ray Show. Like we're always watching you, Ray. Actually, that's one of my favorite movies. That's a great movie. Also, right. uh, people are saying that it's only nine o'clock on the West Coast, so we got three more hours of streaming. Oh, okay. All right. So who's up next? All right, let's go ahead and reset. Here's where Kevin cries. You ready? No, we're going to bed. <laughs> 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 All right, guys, truly, thank you so much. Monk, thanks for hanging out with us, man. I'm sorry yeah, that thanks. on Tuesdays I can't join you. I'm always usually working, and that's our clerical days here at Jackalman, So, But we will. We try to join when we can. We love you, everybody. Yes. Not just Monk, we everybody. We have Kevin back. I'm so happy I have Kevin back. That's great. Yeah. Go to bed, guys. All right, Danny. <laughs> Bye, everybody. Bye. Bye. All right, guys, take it easy. Hey guys, thanks again for watching another live stream with Jackman Games. Please come and see us every Monday at 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time for a great time exploring this wonderful game called Star Wars Destiny. Again, thank you so much to all of our Patreon members, supporters, all the people who like, comment, and subscribe, good or bad. We appreciate everything you're doing to help us build a great community and giving you guys some great content. Please feel free to message us on Twitter, Facebook, or YouTube with any questions. Please let us know if you'd like to ever join us on our cantina, Bibble Destroys, or even our podcast. And again, guys, take it easy. If you enjoyed this video, please be sure to head over to the Jackalman Games Patreon page where patrons receive exclusive content as well as access to our Discord channel where you can interact with Kevin, Ashton, and Ray on a daily basis. Any amount that you can provide is greatly appreciated and we'll see you next time on Jackalman Games. Do you like cracking packs? Join the Jackalman Games Patreon to have a chance to win a box every month. If you like talking about Star Wars Destiny, then join the Jackalman Games Discord. Hit the link below and join today.